Hello everybody, welcome back to the training of the Modicon M221. In this video we're going to still focus on the remote display okay, that we have for the M221, but we're going to see only one of the templates that we have, which is the page monitor. So let's go to the presentation. This page monitor basically allows you to see a list of variables that you have on the PLC and see the actual value. And you also have the possibility to change that actual value. So if we continue with this part of the presentation, you can see what I meant, okay? This is the view. You can define all the variables that you want, okay? And then those variables must be assigned to a percentage M or MW variable to see the actual value, as you can see here in the right part, okay? Then if you have configured to change the value, you can see if it's a Boolean variable, you have this, uh, this view, okay? And if it's a analog value, you can see this view to manually change this if only is applied. So how to add this monitor page is very simple. As we saw in the, pre in the past, we just need to go to display, operator interface, right click over there, add page, select the monitor template and then OK. Then what we need to do is to define the elements that we want to show on that page. So click on elements, define the text that you want to see over here in the left part, then associate the text with a variable. Then you will need to add this combination text and variable into the elements. And then you have the possibility to specify if you want to edit that variable over here. Additional, we if we click on the page name, okay, we can change the title and we can also display some help text when we click on this button in front of the display, just to show more information. So what we're going to do now is to still play with the application we have done in the past, okay, and we're going to add two uh, monitor template pages, one for menu template created in the previous in the past and now we're going to have one for visualize the configuration of the timer that we have configured for our machine and then the configuration for the alarm view okay this one is to go directly to the alarms and this one to visualize the red when we have an alarm so this is the idea okay so we're going to do this together let me just open the application Okay, this is the application that we have. Just open this in the other window. So, display, operator interface, right click, add page, monitor template. Okay, here we can change this. Okay, I'm gonna leave it like this at the moment. Title, config, alarms. I'm going to add another one, add page, monitor. This one should be for uh, config timers. Okay. You can also add the password protection in case you want it. And the password is over here. But I don't want to do that. So elements now for the alarms. For the alarms, I have already mentioned that we are going to use the um, display alarm red okay and this one is the variable percentage s123 that we have seen in the previous video um, auto show alarm okay which is the variable s122 add alarm this is complete now for this one let me just change this name conf I'll conf timer. So the elements over here is the percentage NW. Oh uh, no, by the way, percentage NW10 timer motor on. 
and do a 10 time motor on okay so we have already specified the variables now this is important so if we want to visualize the data okay it's okay there is nothing else to do but if we want to modify those variables we need to specify that we can change that so once the elements are added into our list we just need to click right access simple as that and if we go back to this one we just need to specify right access and that's all so let's continue with this now we have already created pages but we need to call that so in the past we have already created this menu okay that allows us to see different pages so I'm going to go here and call those menus uh, pages so the first one config alarms select config alarm over here add now config uh, timers here select config timers which had in there too okay and that's all so we have already configured this menu template okay which is this one add page the monitor template two of those you can see the image over here in the left is different okay so now we can download this into the target and see the behavior so let me just change the view over here okay good so I'm going to connect to the controller now I'm going to download this new application okay good I'm gonna play this and if you have this problem to just you can remove the cable connect again the cable to sort it out okay good so now you can see on the display that we have the two new uh, menus that we have created so if we go back if we go to timers for example timer one I need to press this one the edit you can modify here with the wheel I will just go up over here and this one is the percentage MW10 if I know wrong so MW10 timer you can see there is nothing at the moment we just need to apply you can see the value 11 over there so we can go back to escape now if we go to the alarms you can display for example display alarm red okay and you can see the arrow that is pointing to the off we can change this to on and then we can apply using this pay attention on this one it should be in true when I press now okay so now when I have a alarm it should be in red okay so let me see if it's something else nope so in this video we just saw how we can use this monitor template to visualize information and change the information that we want um, that we want but we need to select that we want to change otherwise we're going to see the visualization and we cannot change anything okay so this is for the monitor template thank you very much for watching this video and i see you on the next one